to whatever this video ends up being. I guess you'd call it like an addendum to the Polaroid Presto video. With the Polaroid Presto, I had some streaking issues. There's a couple of rollers right here that the picture gets sandwiched in between as it comes out. Um, so I'm assuming something's on there and I could probably look online and figure out how to fix it or clean it or whatever. But there is a toll free number for assistance that is uh, on this camera and I have no idea if it's still in use or if it's active or anything, but we're gonna find out and see if we can get some help with my 42 year old instant camera. On a hundred, two, two, five, one, three, a four. Hello, and please listen carefully as our menu options may have changed. Calls are recorded for quality assurance. We're very excited to tell you about a special promotion for select callers. This will only take a moment. By answering just a few questions, we will find out if this offer is right for you. Are you or is someone in your household 50 years of age or older? Press 1 for yes. If you or someone in your household is 50 years of age or older, otherwise press pound. Yeah, I can. I think I might have dialed the wrong number. I'm trying to reach uh, Polaroid, and uh, yeah, this was the service number I got. I am so sorry. I'm sorry. Um, unfortunately, we're unable to assist you any further, but uh, just for calling in today, you have the opportunity to receive a special gift. So um, just please stay on the line while I transfer your call. Okay. Yes, for calling in today, you are entitled to a... 1-800-225-1384 1-800-225-1384 Yeah, no, um, <laughs> apparently that toll-free number is used by an insurance company or something now. Um, hmm. You know what, let me see if I can find... I wonder if Polaroid has, like, an actual call-in number. Um, <laughs> I was, <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting, but I was not expecting that. All right. Cool. Polaroid. Ooh, there's a Mandalorian edition Polaroid. Contact us. Customer support. Problem with your camera? Yes. Problem with our camera. I don't see, so there's no a phone number that I see. Oh wait, there's a press here for support button. It says I'm being redirected. You can contact our customer support team here or at their email, but who has time for email these days? Submit a request. Man, there is something for vintage camera support. Just put in my email address. Subject streaking on film. You might want to rephrase that. <laughs> yeah, I got some streaking on my film. Look at this. No, um, SX70. 
film issue. That'll be my subject. All right, so I've written a description of, you know, what's wrong. Tell them I think it might be an issue with the rollers, but I'm not positive, and I just ask them if there's any advice that they have on how to clean the rollers or, you know, what else I can do. So, I put in my serial number, selected the type of camera, and attached a picture of the most egregious offense, this one right here. So, let's submit it and we'll, uh, we'll see what happens. No phone call assistance from Polaroid, which is a bit disappointing. I was kind of looking forward to that, mostly just so I could talk to somebody and see if anybody there remembers or knows anything about this camera in particular. Because I, you know, like I, like I mentioned in the video, it's, it's fascinating um, just to see how little information there is on this camera um, on the internet. Apparently there's like some archive services that have like a bunch of like newspaper ads and stuff and it, but there I couldn't find like nobody has actually reviewed this camera that I can tell um, which is odd because the Polaroid instant atmosphere webosphere um, is uh, there's a lot of it out there and I was honestly surprised that nobody has taken the time to do a review on the Presto when there are so many SX70 and One Step and even the 600 series all of those Polaroid cameras have a ton of uh, press out there on the internet but not the Presto so thanks for watching this um, addendum <laughs>